We are joined on behalf of the Trump campaign by Arkansas Senator Tom Cotton. Senator Cotton, thanks a lot for being. We only have a couple minutes. This debate's about to get underway. But I wanted to ask you, which Donald Trump do you think is going to show up tonight? You know him well. Uh, is it going to be the Donald Trump that is going to be making personal attacks, insulting Kamala Harris, or is it going to be the Donald Trump that's going to focus on his issues? John, I think you're going to see that Donald Trump, who's president for four years, who has a clear record. This campaign is unusual. We don't have a candidate running for office for the first time. The American people remember what it was like under President Trump. We had stable prices, rising wages, a secure border, and peaceful, stable relations around the world. Under Kamala Harris and Joe Biden, we've had record high inflation. We've had a wide open border. We've had war breaking out everywhere. The American people are going to remember after tonight that times were good under Donald Trump, and they want another four years of President Trump back in the White House. And I, we noticed he was spending a lot of time looking at the angles, studying the, uh, the debate stage. He does know the television of this as well. Well, he does, but uh, I think the style and the debate stage and the lighting and all that is going to be secondary in the minds of most voters, especially those trying to make up their minds to what they hear from the two candidates about their record. People remember that with Donald Trump, they had good times. They had rising wages. They had stable prices. We had peace and stability. And with Kamala Harris, a dangerous San Francisco liberal, and Joe Biden in the White House, we've had none of that. So I think it's going to be a clear contrast between President Trump and Kamala Harris tonight and the American people starting tonight and over the next eight weeks are going to make the decision that they want President Trump back in the White House. All right. There's Senator Cotton with one side of this debate, very sharply worded. Mary?